we got to Bob, my man, I know you have your own brand, but I had to get you one of the classics. Hope it, you dig it, would be an honor if you wear it, wore it. Dude, honestly, you see this shit right here. Honestly, Brian Turner, look at the fucking hair. I just, I'm wearing a hat all day. Let me put this back on because I look ugly as fuck. All right. So, Brian Turner from, I mean, Humorous Fitness, but also, like, he has Beyond the Week is his line. Dude, real guy, like, literally a friend in the YouTube community. You know, like, Max is Nick and Brandon, Maddie, you know, Scott. All those guys are my friends. He's just like that. It's not about YouTube. We barely talk about YouTube. More of the times we text just about random shit. So thank you so much. He didn't even tell me he was sending it out. I literally just looked and the package was here. So thank you so much. And in honor of you, my friend, I'm going to wear it on chest day today. So here you are, Brian Turner, Beyond the Week chest day. You got it. And also, he also gave me this. I forgot to show it. The week wristband, sick, bro. Beyond the week, what does that mean to me? Well, beyond the week, what it means to me is that you don't take the easy route. You're not the person to say that was enough. And when you start saying enough, you become the weak. Because nothing is ever going to be good enough for the successful man or woman for that matter. Uh, especially in lifting in life, in anything, you always want to be beyond the week. You always want to take it to the next level. You always want to keep pushing yourself. That's the greatest thing about the gym is that there's no finite end. And that's the greatest thing about life if you truly embrace it the proper way is that there is no end. There is no light at the end of the tunnel goal. Of course there's death. Of course, I mean, you could argue what happens after death but during your life as you are living there are, should be no end goal where you just sit back and go okay I'm all set I'm just going to coast through the rest of my life because even if your goal is to retire at 50 and ha and just relax you know even at that point you should have goals about where you want to travel to you know how many lives you want to touch. Um, so in this chest workout, I really kept that in mind. And it was such a great surprise that he hit me up with his tank. Now, it is chest day. And normally, I'd wear a stringer. See, I'm pulling it down. But it was a very, very comfortable tank. And I really, really like the design. It kind of reminds me of like something you'd get at, you know, uh, a Hurley or a, you know, a Pac Sun or like some type of like skater, you know, tank, which is actually pretty cool because I don't have a lot of this design. I am super picky right now with my tanks because I'm moving and because, you know, there is so much that I get, not to gloat, but it's like so much that I get for free. It's like, it was almost to the one point you don't want to accept some of the stuff and you never wear it. And it's like, it's, it's a nice gesture, but unless it's quality, unless I like it on my pale-ass skin, I'm not having it. So, I, w I worked out with Jared today, a.k.a. Aries, the god of war. I need to show you all the clips. Uh, we filmed a lot. This is a new camera for me. It's the T3i, so we were having some fun with it. And you can definitely see Jared's striations a hell of a lot better with this camera than you could before. Um, for those of you who are not familiar with Jared, if you're new to the channel or anything like that, Jared is one of my best friends. He's a fitness model, also a regular model with an agency out of Boston. Um, they told him to lose 10 pounds. 
of muscle, and he would be a New York model. But, you know, I don't know if he wants to do that. I wouldn't do that shit. Um, here we're starting an epic workout uh, technique that all of you should use when you're with a partner and you're both are kind of run down, either that or you just want like to take your workout to the next level, drive some pump, break a sweat. Um, I, I'm sure you guys have heard of sevens. These were fives. And what it is is basically you are do, going back and forth nonstop for five sets or seven sets if you're doing sevens. Um, you want to make sure you keep a relatively lighter weight than normal because your aim is to get 12 to 15 reps each time. So what we did is we ended up doing um, the cable flies and we kept it – This, you know how some cables are like – heavier than others like in ultimate for example is that you know one cable is actually feels heavier than another we only went like 20 or 15 pounds on this and it was enough to really like drive the blood in the muscle we were sweating and like actually panting after this it was actually um pretty exhausting so you should definitely check this out and this is just one of those examples of being beyond the week you know if you feel your your chest workout sometimes it gets slow when you especially when you're benching or you're doing dumb heavy dumbbell work or doing any heavy work and you're like wow i don't have a pump in my chest i don't even feel like i'm working out you know my chest because sometimes your body doesn't respond to the heavy weight that way um so it's good to throw in a drop set throw in a super set just you you kind of be you kind of be a little crazy when you work out and you know what jerry's just enough crazy and i'm super fucking crazy um we both joke around and who's weirder me or jared who, who says the weirder shit and uh <laughs> this is this guy back here was like hey you using that uh that that jump thing i need to uh, you know i need to practice my box jumps and so we were using it as a camera holder so we kind of felt like a little bit of a dick right now but uh it's all right. We're always nice to people in the gym, no matter what. Even if they're complete assholes, you got to kill them with kindness, man. Uh, don't combat negativity with negativity. Uh, and I'm guilty of that sometimes. I get a little butt hurt. I get uh, you know a little heated. But I'm learning. And just like the beyond the week, I'm I realize my weaknesses and I grow. Um, you know. Maybe one day me and Brian will actually get a, uh, a workout in together. You know, he makes me feel pretty horrible about myself, and so does Jared. They're both fucking shredded. Um, as in show prep, I'm feeling a little bit better. Uh, currently, here I was 198, currently sitting at 196 while I'm actually um, making this commentary. But going well so far hopefully i will have some photo shoots scheduled hopefully you know some big things coming with some companies um just trying to give you guys the best products out there and trying to revamp the channel a little bit to incorporate more funny stuff more you know real life stuff more of uh, just the fitness personality in general not just here's workouts here's full days of eating and shit because I, I, I know everyone else is doing that, and uh, I want to I wanna bring mine and my friend's sense of humor into, uh, into the channel. And also, I want to have a little fun with it. I want you to be able to watch the video all the way through. And if you've gotten this far in this video, congratulations. Um, leave a comment below. If you've gotten this far, literally just say, I got that far in the comments below. And I'll know, and I'll show you some love. Um, but definitely revamping the channel with the new camera and actually moving out. It's like literally going to be so easy to get a video. You know, I'm thinking about doing a video Monday through Thursday and Sunday. So that would be five videos a week. You know, and that's a lot. But tell me what you guys think below. Do you want to see more of me? Um, are you cool with every other day? You know, it's not going to hurt my feelings. Um, maybe a little bit. But maybe I was thinking one day be training video, one day vlog, one day eating, one day a skit. And then like, you know, I'll have a bunch of series as well. You know, I'm really trying to revamp the channel to make it something that you want to keep coming back to because I'm a really random guy. So I'm always throwing ideas together. But make sure to like this video below. Make sure to comment and make sure if you're not subscribed, hit that button. Make sure to check out OlympusIron.com if you like the videos for merchandise, 
athlete bios, my bio, and all of my videos posted there. Also, make sure to check me out on Instagram at Olympus Iron, Twitter at Olympus Iron, and find me on Facebook. And as always, train like a god.